to Kenya. The lions are on the hunt. We've lost sight of them now, but they're stalking a lone male waterbuck. They've disappeared and dispersed into the grass. So there's the waterbuck. Now we've lost sight. Oh, I think I see one lioness um, over here to the left sense. There, I think that's, is that a lion? It is. It could be one of the cubs. No, it's an adult lioness. Now, the others have spread out, and one of them was actually heading quite close to where the waterbuck is, although I think that waterbuck is quite safe. It's in the short grass, but the lions are definitely giving it a go. Oh, he doesn't look too perturbed at the moment. Oh, I'm pretty sure one of the lionesses is going to pop out quite close to us in these bushes. The last place I saw it disappear was in here. And I think if the waterbuck runs, it's going to run towards us. So we decided to position ourselves on the other side of where all the vehicles are. And some of you might even notice there's a bus. Uh, those are school children out here for the weekend. And they're all there. It's their camp or their, their trip away. And you can see all their mattresses on the roof. So it's a school bus. I just keep trying to find this lioness. One that was heading this way to try sort of flank around the, 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 the unsuspecting waterbuck. It is an absolutely magnificent morning here in Kenya. I know the poor boys at Juma are being pelted by the wind. We've got a gentle breeze and beautiful weather. Remember, hashtag Safari Live if you've got any questions for us. Maybe he's up. Maybe he knows what's cracking. Maybe he didn't get to this edge by being a fool of a waterbuck. Stick to the short grass and the lions can't sneak up, up upon you. Natalie talking about my shuka. Natalie says it's quite colorful. It is, it is indeed Natalie uh, as colorful as I am I'd like to think oh, So he heads down grazing Mystic wolf loves the shuka me too. I think it's wonderful now, of course, there's so many wonderful different variations of shukas. I think by the time we leave Kenya, uh, I'm probably going to have, well, Jamie and I are probably going to have 50 or 100 different shukas. We're actually going to get one, uh, a really big one made for the bed as a, as a cover. I think that'll look quite spectacular. So I, I didn't quite get who, who, who said that, um, but someone says it goes with my hat. Ah, Lara Moore uh, said it goes well with my hat. Now, there's a very, very important reason why I'm not wearing my normal green hat. And, uh, and you'll see this is a blue hat. It's a new